This is the Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is an Airmex or Hermex brand model CL60T padlock. It's a brass lock with a 10mm hardened steel shackle and a tubular core. Interestingly, the company says this lock should be oiled daily, a recommendation I've never seen before, though it probably contributes to the claimed rust resistance. The company also gives this a 7 out of 10 security rating, which I think you'll agree shortly is more than a bit generous. And that's for a couple of reasons. The first is this lock's susceptibility to padlock shims, an extremely low skill bypass that pretty much anyone can use. We're going to give it a try using these covert instrument shims. First, we will use them to push this little gasket out of the way. Then we can slip it in between the lock body and shackle. And of course, we need to do that on both sides. And once they are in position, we should be able to pull the shackle and it pops open. The other problem is the fact that this lock impression's about as easy as any lock I've seen. We're going to try it using this Covert Instruments tubular lock impressioner. And you can see that worked almost as fast as using a key. And we have the key impressioned. Let's reset this and try it one more time just to make sure that's not a fluke. And one more time, we opened it as fast as using a key. All right, folks, this lock's susceptibility to two low skill attacks is, in my view, inexcusable, and it certainly makes this a lock to avoid. Of course, maybe if I had oiled it every day, as per the maker's instructions, it would have performed better. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.